Enjoy. to participate, I encourage you to do so. Mm -hmm. it's, it's fun to be a part of something that really gets the AAC word out there. The current committee chairs are, well, the committees themselves, are the Education Committee, Nominations Committee, Advocacy and Public Policy, Membership, woohoo, <laughs> AAC Awareness, Public Information, Development, Disaster Relief, which I don't know if anyone was within the hurricane paths, but USAC is really good at helping people to get something if they need it, if their stuff is damaged or, or lost. Um, so encourage your families to reach out to USAC for disaster relief. Uh, DEIA for our, Ooh, USAC for our, and, and Tracy, um, uh, diversity, equity, inclusion, and I didn't get it. Accessibility. That's a good word. I know that one. I can do it. All right. So, and then the research committee. So, Chris, would you please tell everyone about the benefits of being a member? Because we want them all to join, like tomorrow or today. When you join USAC, you also become a member of Isaac. You get reduced registration fees for the semi-annual Isaac conference registrations. You will have free registration to use as four to six webinars offered throughout the year. Great information. Members get priority consideration as guest speakers on Speak Up, USAC's Law. Members get reduced registration fees for an T I A. USAC has a new member finder which Mike will explain further. Uh -huh. That's an old message. Mike's not here. <laughs> <laughs> That's your new name. Oh wait, Chris, take a moment. Wait, wait, wait. So the member finder you don't know what that is, USAC now has an ability for people to look up in wherever within USAC um, if they want to find another family that lives around, or someone else who has uh, an adult agency user who they think would be fun to communicate with. 
um, an SLP in their area. So depending on the information people have put in for their um, uh, contact information, uh, it's a network to get people to find others. Now, I think non-members are able to go in and look for people uh, allowing others to find mentors, service providers, and more. Uh, so the feature is going to allow non-members to look up people within USAC and then USAC members to look within the organization. So it's a good one. Okay, now keep going. The USAC Speaker Connection works to reimburse AAC communicators for their unique contributions and speaking engagements. So you can apply for a grant to be reimbursed. Members receive a reduced rate for the subscription to the AAC Journal. Members are included in participating in our committees. So it's really fun to be part of the committee because you get to be part of decision making, you get to be part of organizing some activities. Uh, the awareness committee did a great job in getting uh, something going uh, next week or so. There's something that I saw posted at least five times on Facebook. Go ahead. <laughs> USAC is a great place for networking, meeting fantastic people, and learning amazing things. Nice. Very good. So, just like this, not quite as awesome as this, but just like this, lots of networking opportunities. So if you're not already a member of USAC, and you'd like to be, we've got some, Tracy put some information on the table back over here in the corner. Chris has has offered to bring along some of his buttons and swag that we have. So if anyone's interested in some of the buttons that you said has, uh, there's one that says, I'm worth the, worth the wait, let me communicate. Don't leave my voice in the bag. Um, silence is not always golden. And wait 15 seconds, I can communicate. So if you think about some of your Friends, clients, uh, classmates, someone that might need someone to understand that they just need a moment to get their message out. Um, come hit us up, we'll share some buttons with you. And if you don't have, we don't have one that you want today, I have a button machine in my house. I'll make you whatever you need. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so as we said before, the speaker connection is a web based portal enabling businesses, schools, and organizations to find and engage individuals who use AAC as invited feed speakers. How often have you adults been asked to hop into a webinar and tell them your AAC journey and tell them all about your disability and you just, Chris, you just need to pop in and tell us a little bit about why you don't wear shoes um, <laughs> for nothing. You know, we'll all do something as a volunteer every now and again, but if you're asked to do these things over and over and over again, you should be paid for your time. So, yeah. So, so you can register as a, speaker, as a speaker in the speaker connection and create a free profile and event organizers can find you to say, hey, we need somebody. I think that one looks nice. I'm just kidding. I don't know how they pick people up. <laughs> uh, online chats. They have an Isaac chat every month, I think it is, uh, for people to... Uh, get connected and talk about different topics each month. Um, you'll get an email reminder and sometimes a Facebook reminder if you're part of that, I think. Uh, I definitely get emails uh, saying that the ISAC chats are going on. Um, I am not invited, so I don't know what they talk about. <laughs> so by becoming a member, you can click on this QR code that may or may not get you to the right page. If it doesn't, <laughs> Uh, if you go to isaconline.org uh, and look up membership, there should be a page that gets you to, I want to renew my membership, or I want to have a new membership. And I think when I made this code at one point, unless this is the new one that Tracy made, it went to the wrong page. Is this a new one, Tracy? Well, see, she's smarter than I am, so it's a good QR that I didn't have in mind. So we'd love for you guys to Think about being members, ask other families to be members. Um, 
It is in Canadian funds, so when you look at the price, make sure you do a little conversion because it's cheaper in the States in the Canadian dollars. We get more for our money. Uh, uh, a little bit. Uh, <laughs> please take stuff so I have less to take with me. <laughs> yes, did you hear that? Tracy would like you to take all this. Oh, so the luggage tags are intended to be put on devices so that as they travel, it's big and bright and yellow, so you can find it in a rush, um, especially for emergency preparedness. Um, it's also great on a suitcase, but it's a nice tag to have for luggage tags. Uh, there's information about you stack on the table, along with, if you become a member, you get to put a yellow flag on the bottom of your name tag to show off all the love. Um, so those are there as well. Okay, I'm gonna ask Thank you, everybody. Do you have questions for us? We have a question in the back right here. Um, do you get uh, discounts to the Isaac and uh, our virtual conference when it comes around? Because maybe next week or the week after? I'm pretty sure, yeah, I think you do. So the mm -hmm. vibes for AAC conference is the end of this month. And uh, it's, uh, someone else asked me online if there was, Tracy, have you talked about Rob? Yeah, no, uh, India says no, don't even say it. Uh, it was supposed to be in 20, it was thought possibly 2024. Eventually they'll get back on the schedule, now that we're in human travel times again. But yeah, there's, <laughs> being part of any of these conferences, just like this, the stuff that we're learning, the stuff that we're sharing, the experiences that we're having, you say it's another good one to learn to share. Any other questions? Yes, there is a student grade, absolutely, absolutely, get in while you're a student. So we should join this organization as well as What happens is when you become a USAC member, you get an ISAC number. Um, ISAC is run through Canada and they uh, oversee everybody. All of the 12 chapters around the world? How many? That sounds right. Yeah? I thought so. I thought I was making something up. It's around 12. I counted it once. I don't remember what I had for breakfast, even though it was really 